Well, I'm very happy to be here today at the company design and Technikin Ampfing Bavaria. The person next to me is Mr. Bayer from the company Grips. Together with Design and Technik, they have thought about something. An automated pipetting station. Why exactly do you have to automize the pipetting process? What exactly are you doing there? Please fill me in about the latest updates. When I look at such a standard corona sample, then I can't actually test it right away. First of all, I have to remove the liquid and transfer it to a testable jar. For this, we have a so-called deep well plate. Those plates have 96 small boxes inside. And here I have to put on a tip onto the pipette, open the sample, take out the liquid, and pipette it into this plate. What our robot now generally does is to automize the complete process, including the reading of the QR codes in the samples, including the allocations about in which field which sample lands, it also measures, after the sample has been pipetted out, the filling level in the pipette tip to see if there was enough liquid inside the sample. It can completely sort out and avoid the majority of the mistakes a normal staff member would do. And is the station also faster than a human being? Well, yes, if such a normal pipetter, let's say, works on it in the laboratory. It takes about 45 minutes up to an hour for this whole panel, the 96 samples I need, not only for one. Exactly. This is done by our robot within 10 minutes. So, you are saving up a lot of time. You were probably working on this for a long time. How long did it take from the first idea until the machine was ready? At the end of the year, around December, we started to realize this. And now, in the beginning of May, we are more or less done with it. I can tell you, the first automated machine is already standing in the laboratory. And everything functions perfectly. Next to me, you can see Mr. Grimberg from the company Grips Automation. He's the CEO. Mr. Grimberg, why did you choose the company Amron to realize this COVID tester? Well, first of all, we're working together with the company Amron for a quarter of a century. So, 25 years all in all. We developed a lot of system integrations together. About that, the company Amron offers a very wide product range that supported us in the overall solution. It starts with the displays and continues with the robots, the barcode readers, the drive technology, the control system, and so on. And this simplifies our life insofar as they deliver a complete smart solution. I think that Industry 4.0 was also a big topic here, on which we should emphasize. And here, I think, you were able to find the right products. Yes, of course, the topic Industry 4.0 is being discussed a lot right now. In this case, talking about COVID, traceability and other things, the job is to collect data, to save it and to process it. This is quite definitely our passion, or a topic that we are realizing pretty well with these products. Okay, thanks a lot. So then I wish you a lot of luck with this unit. It's totally great what you have developed here. And I want to thank you that you allowed us to have a look at it today. Thank you very much for the conversation.